go. Let God. Give it up to God. Let it go. Let it be. All these things that we say to ourselves, and people say to us when we've got anger, hurt, anxiety, depression, whatever it is, that we should let it go. We should get it out of us. Get it out, get it out. We need like an extraction. We need like a surgery. And, and the thing is, is I'm, I'm really good at letting it go. And I'm really good at giving it up to God and letting it be and all that kind of good stuff. The problem is I keep taking it back. <laughs> I just keep taking it back. I need some, I need, I need God to be like, no backsies. <laughs> like, I need to give it and then I need to not go get it again. I, it's so frustrating. It's, it really, it, it's making me crazy. Um, it really is. I, I, I thought that every time I think that I've, I've, I've given this, given it up, that I've let it go, it is what it is, and it's not going to get to me. Here I am sitting here again. I thought about it for a couple of minutes, sort of because it's something I can't ignore. And and now all of the the anxiety is back, the squeezing of my heart, the feeling of hopelessness. And I hate it, and I hate feeling like this. And so I will breathe and I will be mindful and I will let it go. I will give it up again and I will find peace again. And one of these days that peace is going to last. And see the ugly little voice in my head that lies? You know, you know the voice in your head that lies to you all the time? You know that voice. The voice that says really mean things, really nasty things, really sad things, really angry things. Yeah, the voice in my head was like, that's never gonna happen. It's never gonna get solved. It's gonna ruin your life. Yeah, thank you, voice in my head. Shut up, voice in my head. You, you guys hear voices too, right? It's not, not just me. <laughs> but yeah, it's, um, so it's not easy. And it happens to everybody. And you know, I mean, maybe it doesn't happen to the Dalai Lama, but I suspect that it does because I don't think that there's any being on this earth that is, that is completely able to always be at peace with everything. I mean, he's pretty darn close, but I got to imagine there's stuff that gets under his skin sometimes too. And, and what, what I, what I'm trying to not have happen, uh, and I'm doing pretty good with this, is to not compound the problem by beating myself up too much about it, because that can happen too. Then I can be all like, oh sure, yeah, you're gonna start a channel where you're gonna motivate and inspire people. Oh yeah, because you've got it together. Yeah, look at you. you, you just can't get past this situation that's happening, and you, you, it, it, it's making you crazy and it's giving you anxiety and it's it's just you stink but i haven't done that too much just a little bit just a little bit and i think the best thing i can do is just sit here and tell you that sometimes i take it back i give it away i let it go and i go running after it and i take it back and then i breathe and I pray, and I let it go again. I'm letting it go right now. It's going, it's tugging a little bit, it doesn't wanna go. But I'm letting it go. Because I wanna enjoy my life, and I don't wanna feel like this. I wanna feel free and, and happy, so I'm letting it go. Maybe it will go for a long time, or maybe in a few hours it might come back.
maybe I should get like an emotional and mental like tennis racket. So every time it comes back, I can just swat at it. <laughs> just bang, back in your court. I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted to share that with you because uh, you know, this is life is about it being real and sometimes it's real and sometimes even though right now I'm smiling and laughing, uh, sometimes I'm smiling and laughing and, uh, and, and in pain and scared. You just can't tell. So anyway, that's all I have to say for today.